Uh, it's hot. Southern hot. We're in Virginia. A. At any rate, you know, Virginia, this is a lemon, lemonade, whatever. This is lemonade. I know we're in the South and I should be having sweet tea, but I'm not really into that much sugar. So there you go. I suffer. Oops. There's a lot of other stuff that's happening too. But look, let me get to it real quick. Right? I know I usually give you some healthy tips or something like that, but what the hell? You're not interested in that. Um, my, my sister's in there right now. She's got to go later. She's watching something on TV. There's some, some sort of round table with Trump. It's all Republicans dealing with the race problem. <sighs> race issues. I got to say this. I don't know. Why? And race has been steady for so long. There's been so many commissions, blah, 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 blah. You don't need no commissions. You don't need to pay these, whatever. You don't need nobody. And least of all, just have the Republic. I, look, I don't want to hear it. And whatever, they, whatever he doing, think of it. Trump is the source. If Trump ain't did you right better, why do you think he's going to do you right now? No matter what the pressure, that boy is stubborn. He, he pure. I said this a long time ago. Now, I know people realize now. He gangster. I said one time, the reason why Bernie ain't going to win because Bernie ain't gangster, gangster. You know? My good friend, my good friend, you know? So anyway. So, why? If you don't know by now, it don't make no sense. And plus, you always put up, and you know, it's the same source that puts out misinformation or whatever information. I'll, I'll see what I mean. This whole thing about uh, they want to defund the police. Now, oh, sorry. I'll take that off. Defund the police. No, I won't put that back on. I'm on the cool. Well, what does that mean? They said, well, what does that mean? We don't know what that means. And there's a there's an example. Maybe I should put that link too of uh, Newark, Newark, New Jersey. Laura Flanders did a program uh, on Newark, New Jersey, and how, they de how they've been dealing with the situation that they have. That basically, you take the... Uh, look, Mr. Neely and Fuji Jr. says, these are not police. These are law enforcement. Whatever the law is and whatever it takes to enforce, that's what they do. Police, policing is something totally different. You know, throughout the years, they made policing do be babysitters, more or less, oh, whatever. But it's not the same thing. I don't want to get all bargain on the technical, but however. So when they say something like defunding the police, what they mean is defunding the gangsters in the police. The white, you know, the white supremacists that grew their head out so you wouldn't see the tattoos and put on suits and, and just, and, 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 or, and they, and they walked into a police department and said, hey, or, or, or worse still, they, they knew they was doing. And so what they did was they they, they went, purposely went into the military, especially whatever it is, to get the training so they can come back. They, oh, you're a veteran. So they can, now they now they all amped up as a, as a whatever. So, so so then they come and now you have you have a, 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 a police force that trained by the U.S. But it's not, well, you know what they are. They're trained by the U.S., but these guys... They're white supremacists, nothing racist white supremacists, dedicated to eliminating black folks. Okay, problem. Okay, that's the problem. Now, I, I, so defunding the police means defunding that kind of situation where you have this riot gears and all the rest of the stuff for some particular reason. And you, you know, you, I think you can put it into to community policing or something else. You can take that money. You don't need these. Ooh, this stuff is terrible. You know, these cats. And everybody knows it. That's the problem. And in fact, they have this they have this mentality. It's like no cop left behind. Where did you hear that before? No, no soldier, no, none of our people left behind. That's a war situation. You see? So let's see what happens. Because this is going to nothing. I mean, you gotta stay, you gotta you gotta stay, and we gotta do what we gotta do. Just ignore Trump. Ignore these Republicans. Along the, ignore these Democrats. We gotta come up with some other plan. We we will. We we are. Just they are not what you think they are. And why are you gonna to capitulate to this very same people who will take your money, take your tax money, put it into put it into weaponry? You know uh, that that that, that uh, I guess Bush and and uh, who's that guy? Uh, Obama and uh, Biden and uh, who's the next? And Trump or you know say the same thing. Let's militarize the police force. Give them these tanks and their, their, their gear and the helmets and ding 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 ding. Because that what? Nah, ain't happening. So this is really interesting what's happening now. I'm going to monitor it, but I, yeah. But I'll put a link into the, the Laura Flanders thing about Newark. 
Linkage. What's the proof of linkage? I'll put a link into it. You'll see what happens. Later. When I say later, that, that's later from me, T, from the Patterson's taking the train to spit, letting you know what I, um, you know, I'm slowly suspecting.